Have you noticed any changes? Did something happen? <gasps> new sofa, new shirts. New sofa, new you with a new shirt that you could have like this shirt or this one. 1,000 subscribers, should we say it together really nerdy? One, <laughs> <laughs> there was a vicious rumor that someone started that I was going to dance once we hit a thousand subscribers and I don't, I don't, um, you know, that's folly. It's not a rumor. Here's the clip. <laughs> this was in the top five list. Okay. Of Corey movies. This is supposed to be like him at his best and that's what we've been searching for. We haven't always found it. So I'm looking forward to seeing a good performance uh, in a good movie. Dinger, Dinger, wake up for a minute. I gotta talk to you, buddy. I'm dreaming. Vanna White. I like this intro because we've already established a lot of stuff about them. They've already kind of put us in this world. I don't think you understand. They're no, slobs. I do understand, I really do. Yeah, he rips up comic books that tape the pages to his wall, which is opposed to the Edgar Frog character who reveres the comic books. Are we talking about Joel's Laney? Hold on. Are we talking about Laney, the one that looks great in a leotard, Laney? All right, I gotta wrap my head around, because I know this film starts in a different way. It's really them kind of just talking shop in the bedroom for a while, right? Well, that's all we're getting. <clears throat> Michael Jackson. Okay, earring, bandana, collared shirt. So they're really going for style on Corey Haim. Yes. Are you done with your Indian mating ritual yet? This is different. It's a different kind of intro. It, has nothing it really... <laughs> Puts the two Corys front and center. Well, I, it's also from another era, the 1989, so we're still cutting film, so we're gonna get a lot longer cuts. They were both, according to Corey Feldman and Haim, uh, both heavily on drugs during this time. Feldman was actually introduced and in messing with heroin. Oh. Well, that's a tough drug to uh, give a great performance on because it? it makes you very sleepy. Money. Uh, raid Corey's hair right here. Corey uh, Feldman. Jeez, I gotta say Feldman. Uh, I'd say this is top five Corey Feldman hair. I think it's too much. It's too too much volume for me. I don't know why. So these guys spend a lot of time together. Right, we're five minutes into this movie and this is all they've done. It's almost like they're in prison. Like they're, yeah, kind of. Yeah, but they're like bond or at a summer camp or something. They're bonding in their bedroom. What are the filmmakers saying right now? What's the story? The saying? filmmakers are introducing this guy that's completely out of touch. He's doing karaoke to like an Edison wax cylinder or something. <laughs> like, like who cares? There's no other way to show he's old. So, okay, so they're showing us that he's old. Oh, so it's like a 78 acetate that that's playing off of. Oh, there is a crowd. Yeah, why was it no crowd and then a crowd? Uh, symbolism, uh, empty death, um, alone. I think what I'm saying right now is that out loud, I don't understand cinema. Out loud? Out loud. Out loud. Good morning. Gina, I had this fantastic dream. You always have a dream. I don't want to hear about your crazy dream right now, okay? It was about the old guy that, you know, from the shortcut, the, the, with the shortcut we take every day to school. Well, he was in it, Bobby. That's just stupid. Gina, it wasn't. <laughs> well, that's a good way to end a scene, I suppose. <laughs> what just happened? Oh, Bobby. That's just stupid. <laughs> Cut to the chase. We all need friends like that, I think. It's a bit jumbled to me. I know what they're doing. I know how it's done. I know what can be done, and I don't like it. Right, well, I think the director and the DP shot it up to be edited that way. What? They're cutting holes in their jeans that's... right in there. I've never seen anyone do that. No one does that. They, you have to wash them in order for the fray to come he out. He just cut them up before going to school. No, that's a mistake. You already have too much. That was the thing, right? A lot of moose and dudes here? Yeah, moose was the thing for sure. Look how cool and... I think this is really to show how cool they are, but I don't think so. I don't want to be them. What time did they wake up? for school to have this conversation, to do their hair, to get dressed, and then to talk about stuff. They'd be up 10 minutes before they had to leave. Yeah. 
I'm not waking up at 5.30. Yeah, it was still like night or black or whatever. <laughs> Finally, some 80s fat. So, you know, really comment below. Did you think that what they were wearing in this time was cool? Be honest, not from when you were younger. We all thought it was cool. We were wearing guest jeans if you could afford them. I could never not, had any. Could not. Look how many, he cut his jeans that much. And he just cut them. They wouldn't fray like that. How many times have I told you this is private property? Every day, sir. I think I knew when I watched this when I was younger that they were on drugs. I, you know, you don't know. No right. Way. But something was off and it was a little disconcerting. I'll tell you what, sir. Um, we're very sorry and this will never happen again. Never, ever. Never, never. Was that red? Was that it was. He had the red mist. Oh, shit. Ha where are... Okay, I'm gonna say this again like a broken record. What just happened? Why did we just see her and then immediately cut away to uh, an 84 Impala? This is a... And an MR2. Much more experimental film than I thought. Yeah, right? They're expecting us to try to follow. And it is dry. He's still wiping off from the red? I would never sit on that patio thing. Look at, I would never sit on look that. Look how janky that is. Like, I, I don't trust you guys who built this. Okay. Oh no, I thought we were going to that dancing montage. What happened to that girl dancing? Yeah, and now it's just... Hey! Why is this cool? Like, okay, so this was a thing too in movies where, in the 80s movies especially, where drinking and smoking were kind of cool. Right. I, I know you're distracted. Tell me what kind of car that is. That's a Thunderbird. I don't know Thunderbirds that well, so I don't know what year. Thunder Falcon? Um, Cougar, Cougar Falcon Thunder... <laughs> really enter the dream state. Well, who knows? Maybe I could live forever. So the old man just wished to be young again. No, 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 no. Come on, stop looking at her. Want to get your ass kicked? No. They're out getting wasted. <coughs> oh, and they've got a Mustang. Like I was saying before, 80s movies really brought up that, hey, it's cool to smoke, it's cool to drink. Like at school, that dude was taking a swig of something oh, right. before class. Like, that's not cool. You don't really need that stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you just do an anti, like, drug comment? This is, is crack. crack. No, I knew people that did that, and... But it was never to be cool, it was because they were so sad that they had to drink at school in order to get through life. Yeah, they weren't high-fiving each other to the next class after taking a swig or something. No. They were very depressed. Right. And you did not want to be them. You know, we're watching this in 2023, and... I have fond memories of both the Corys and of even some of this film, but not a lot of it, not all of it holds up. And I'm sure this was marketed as a two Corys movie. Double the Cory. Right? And we're barely getting anything. Why are some of them barefoot and then they all have different shoes on? These are the bad kids. Okay, They're so those are the real bad kids. Yeah. Look at all those, those studs that the guys Right. Have. He wrote. Yeah, check out the tits on that one. Hey, that's my girlfriend. Yeah, I know. He wrote flipping rock. <laughs> like, oh, these are the best examples. And there was like one guy that could pull off this hair every day. Right. But there weren't like a bunch of them. This dude's drinking. Is that Coors or what is that? It just says beer. I love beer. On the steps in an auditorium or a gymnasium. They're so casual about it in a lot of these things. Like the Scott Bayo where he was like smoking weed in his bedroom and at the breakfast table yeah. and in in the bathroom. You would get told on. <laughs> Thing handed down from generation to generation. It's like this traditional. So another fun fact that uh, I looked up um, was that Corey Haim was not originally in this film and then he was added on to it, but the reason he's walking with the cane is because like a week before filming started, he was teaching his mom how to ride a motor uh, cycle and crashed. She broke her nose and he broke his leg. <laughs> and he just took off the brace. They took off the brace during filming and he wore a fake one. It's not even a real one. Wow. But he le legit broke his leg right before filming. Wow. And he still has a, well, I guess because he was on drugs and stuff. But. Stop telling me to relax. Okay, I won't. Let it flow through you. Extend out. This is an interesting film. They're loading up a lot of the cinematography with the storytelling and the, the directing and, and the editing into this 
mm -hmm. time or swap kind of thing. Yeah. They're really loading it up. Stop it. This is not out of nowhere. This is on, the main on, piece of the film so far. It's all leading. To do. To do. Go, run. Run. Go with it. Run. He's telling him to run despite him actually breaking his leg right. like two weeks before. There's more stolen valor here. Like he's wearing the <laughs> he's wearing the military uniform, and I don't remember a lot of people doing that. Maybe they thought it was punk. Maybe it was more popular in L.A. It's probably yeah, and popular there. Van Morrison. This was for old people. Back then. I was just about to say this feels like an older style movie, older people style movie. Yeah, I don't think this is for teenagers in no. 1989. I think this is for old people. You guys didn't see each other? They're dead. Yeah. What was the... Where am I? Symbolism. Right. Telling me Oreos. Think. He's on drugs. I, don't look at me, sir. I'm totally clean. What? What's going on? He's moving. You'd think I can... So now the film is going into Where's the body swap thing. Where's and in the shot? 80s, you mentioned this last time in a different video, but yeah, there were a ton of body swap movies, fads. Yeah. I think it was like five movies in the span of two or three years where they had nothing but this kind of stuff. Yeah, for sure. I'm that kid. Lost Boys poster. There you go. The Cory verse. What happened to the bodies of the old people? They um, dematerialized in a violent, horrible way. Off screen somehow. Wouldn't that have been crazy if they were like, ah, <laughs> this is excruciating. <laughs> day. It was amazing. What happened? Gina. Oh, they're ghosts? Where were you? Or like dead or something. Why the TP? Always. But I couldn't find you. You didn't know where to look. Where to yeah, they're dead. They're ghosts. Oh, hey, Pops. Welcome to Dreamland. Good question. Oh, they're both you, in the same body. You yes. Don't seem to have any of the answers. What do you know about all of this? Shit. I'm just caught in a dream. Well, where am I? His acting's really good here. Wherever you are. I can't tell if you're being sarcastic. No, it's more authentic than other performances. I really think the vitamins help. No. Oh. You got shit, pal. It's okay though. Supernatural? They got a little supernatural. We do get Corey Haim though. Right. Bobby, isn't there anything? They didn't get another actor. They just Look, rolled with him with broken leg. Yeah. You're already on the boys VP most I guess the jacket's supposed to be punk, but it's all military. Like you have to have punk band patches on it too. It's okay, pal. I know, I know. I've been there. So he's on Rockstar Vitamins, and he put his mom on the back of a motorcycle, crashed it, and he's like, "Hey, I still get to be in movies, whatever." Yeah. And he did. Yeah. And he's good in it. It's just crazy to me, he literally broke his leg and now he's in the film. You need a good yeah, drugs make sense. All right. Hey, how many times have I told you that this is private property? What? Oh my God, come on. I, I gotta say I really relate and like Corey Haim a lot more than I thought. And yeah. more than Feldman. Yeah, and their chemistry is great. Chemistry's great, but who's the A actor? I'm gonna say it's Haim. Feldman, I think, is a little broader in his ability in that he is, he can also do the Batman voice. What about Donatello? We never mentioned Donatello. Right? He's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Last night you hurt Lane, do it again when I hurt you. No comment. Just, no. No. I'm still, I'm looking at this guy's jacket. With the fringe? With the fringe. Like, 79, I would have taken the fringe jacket. 89, no way. No, 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 no. All right, there she is. Go apologize. Was that available at the Perfect. Limited? Whoa. Say hey, huh, Bob? <laughs> I didn't see the hat. I was too busy looking at the Drunken State t-shirt uh, safety pin on the back of the Stolen Valor jacket. Ah, the I... one it, dude. Like, just stolen everything. Right. 
was screaming saxophone. That's what I was looking at. Uh, that's not a thing. I must realize that ignorance is the only slavery. Robert Green Anderson, 1876. It just cuts and now we, okay. That was the end of that interaction. Right. Yeah. There must be a lot of things you don't remember. A lot of hands. Now I'm just looking at I know. <laughs> Are they? I don't think that's attractive, but. No. Are we jazzercising or it's dancing, right? So is he like stalking her? Because she's with another dude, right? Right. But he knows. He thinks his yeah. wife is trapped inside of her. Sure. No. The old, I think my elderly wife is trapped inside me, so I have to. I'm really hoping you're a 78 year old broad. <laughs> so I'm gonna come watch you dance. Okay, so now the, the dancing scene that's going to come up makes a little bit more sense where he's sort of dancing through those old physical oh. styles because he's this old guy that is trying to impress the girl. That's something. And we know why he's trying to impress her because he thinks his wife is trapped inside of her. But then, how does the old guy pull off the Michael Jackson moves that Corey Feldman would do? Well, that's because like, Corey, like, fights back good, and, you know, you know Shimon. Really, really <laughs> By the power of Shimon, I dance through you. <laughs> oh, now they're going different ways. Gotta look at the shoes. Brought to you by Adidas. You know what I miss is British Knights. <laughs> BKs? BKs, bro. Oh, yeah. I had some of those. Didn't those have pumps too? They, they didn't have pumps, okay, but okay. they were puffy. I think. Well, I'm just trying to be myself. Gold chain, huh? Only rocker chicks rode on their jeans like that. Preppy dance girls didn't ride on their jeans like that. And that yes patch looks like it's like stapled on. It doesn't A lot of barely hang like on. Yeah. And I don't no think fashion. The, well, I don't think the costume coordinator, or whatever they're called, had a big enough budget or enough time or something because they're really struggling with getting these looks right. I'm going to go the opposite direction and say that they had a plan and they were going to execute it. And then Feldman and the actors all ran amok and said, no, 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 I want this now. And oh, you know what I just saw yesterday? This, I want that. And then staple it on. I don't care. It's probably both of those things. I know it's a dream. As you were. You He's were so cool that he wears half tuxedo, half board shorts. Absolutely. And he looks terrible in it, but that's what makes him cool? You see, I like it here. It's... Well, it's so, dream. If you catch my drift. <laughs> Don't you want to get back It's to not that good. <laughs> Like I want to see an old guy in high school not understanding how to navigate all of those social situations. You know what they should have done? They should have just put that older actor in a Cory wig and all of his clothes, <laughs> and then he has to just, you know, hate fellow young people. Right. We have to go back and talk about this. How did the old guy put this outfit together? Where do you even start? Well, there's a copper pipe for no reason. Is that like a... A little doll made of metal right. on it. And other then, things they got at the hardware store. A, just, a rock climbing carabiner. How, how heavy is that? A belt that's not through the loop. It's probably a pound. I mean, hanging off your belt, you're not gonna there's a bullet. <laughs> there's another bullet. <laughs> what is that? Like a 50 cal? That's a major Yeah, this is a giant bullet. <laughs> okay, he is definitely Michael Jackson. I gotta say, so, I wish I was I felt as cool as he thinks he is. I just wanted to fill you in regarding last night. I wanted to tell you that I was not a cool dude, right? And also, like, I was totally unchilled, and, um, you know, I should really chill out some more, right? I don't appreciate you hitting on me, and I don't think your best friend would either. So why don't you go away? Lady, I don't think you see what I'm trying to do here. I think that bandage is not really doing its job. What is he doing? <laughs> That's not really... You broke into her locker? Oh yeah, Haim is in this movie too. Right? Like why is he even in this? Why'd they pay all that money for him? Because Corey and Corey puts butts in seats. That's Corey. Right. And he's being athletic? He's got a good body. <laughs> what are they doing? Anybody else? It's nothing but Chad's. 
Tai Chi doesn't make you good at fighting. Jesus, even her mother likes me. It's driving crazy. That dude's you know? jacket will not <laughs> quit. I love it, actually. <laughs> it's in the turtleneck. Laney, I can't figure out. Right, and it's got like a giant patch on it. You know, I'm not even making fun. Why don't you what are, what are those on his shoulders? I mean, why, why those can't you just those are um, like bike hair. reflectors. <laughs> How could I not see that? Instead of epaulets. How could I have not I seen mean, that? I mean, so long, I knock you out. You understand It's that? bananas. <laughs> It's totally bananas. I love and then it. there's like chandelier parts. I love it. He's just stealing from houses. All right, I'm paying close attention. But I think this is all old guy, right? Okay, yes. So now we know the context, right? So it's not just, hey, this is Corey being bizarre and crazy. This is in the context of the film. He's an old guy. And now he's creepily watching her. Right. And the reason that he's going like, oh. Yes. It's the Dream a Little Dream song from gotcha. the beginning, right? Gotcha. Old guy did some research into what young people are into, and that's how he put together the outfit and how he learned the Michael Jackson dancing. But she just told him, like, go away and stop hitting on me. This is not good dancing. Look, I know I'm going to have no, to do it's, something it's like good. this. This I can do. We're already better than him. <laughs> We don't have to make a separate video. We're just as good, if not, or better dancers than Corey Feldman. If I could bottle what he has in this film in confidence, I could walk into anywhere at any point and do this dance and not care. I think I'm killing it. You think it's all about confidence, it's not. When you watch this back, you'll see that Corey's better than you still. He is. He's miming now. Oh, that time. was not good miming. It's a long time to mime. How do you want to start this? All right. Time didn't pass. Now we're at the restaurant that they were at before. Oh, yeah. Sitting on a janky escape uh, ladder. System. Yeah, a rusted balcony. Yeah. They look cold. By the way. Very breezy out there. <laughs> yeah, it's. The reality it's, of that it's would not be nice. pretty sketchy. If I take you someplace else where nothing weird happens, will you come with me? So is she still dating that other dude, or is the... You can't take someone else's girl out on a date like this. I'll get that fixed. Coleman? Yeah. They wrecked the car? Oh, bummer. Are uh, you gonna get back yet? In your all-white suit, except for the... Look at those shoulder pads. Ugh. I guess I'm gonna have to repeat the experiment. It'll work. Don't worry. Thank you for everything. That shot is very sobering, somber. <laughs> that looks like right. from a different movie. Find a way. They're jumping around so much. I bet. What? Well, he's gotten into a lot of scraps. Yeah. Look at this. His belt. You know, it's no wonder I'm so screwed up. I mean, look at you guys. You don't even talk to me. You don't even ask me if anything's wrong. You don't even ask me if I'm hurt. Fine, take out your shoulder pads and let's sit down and talk about it. Get rid of that ridiculous outfit. I'm trying my hardest. I, I cannot do this without you. Okay. That's actually pretty good acting. I, I pretty like, good. I like that moment. This moment's right. good. There's some good moments here. I could see a teenager talking to their parents like that if they had to, if they could articulate that and right. their emotions and stuff on. Wow. Wow. <laughs> this is also- Boy room. When, Girl room. Okay, now, <laughs> do we really need to explain anything? <laughs> right? Look at what's happening and you'll get it. I love when power ballads could like tell the story. Goodbye to the sofa. You're you guys don't know what you're missing. <laughs> 126 of you know exactly what you're missing. <laughs> They're going through some kind of tunnel of thought together. We saw her in the house a few minutes ago. Impressive. They didn't have to do that. That takes a while to do. They should have done it more. Yeah. And where's Corey Haim? I need the hamster. What happened? I still have a chance. Would you wear that suit? I mean, in general. I can't. If you thought it was cool right now. No, I never would have worn that. I would have gone more to the rocker side. This is more of like a preppy fashion side. Yeah. So that the hair doesn't match all the clothes that he's wearing. Secondly, the interaction between these two is pretty good too. I know we're talking a lot over this, but there's not a lot being said. If you're watching this video, you've probably already seen this movie. You know what happens. Yeah. Guess that's it. Why does he have a busted lip? 
because everything's reflected upon him, not Corey. Corey. Everything he says bounce off me and sticks on you. Just open the door and go in. You're leaving me for Corey She Coleman? sees him. Why would she walk away? So you're admitting right now. That I don't understand cinema? Right now. Let there be absolutely no Because tests are very serious in high school and they, they reflect everything about you moving forward in life. I barely remember high school. It's an allegory for life. Oh man, now I'm saying out loud. What, that? what was that? <laughs> Did we die? That's the one time they made to show time passing and they chose to do that instead. There he is. Okay, bye. Yep. What? Okay, so now. Whoa, dude, no. Shout out to our female audience, all 10% of you. 10%, yeah. hey. Comment if you had that hair in the 80s. That hair in the back right back. there. He will never leave that jacket alone. He loves, he is that jacket now. <laughs> He's that jacket. He's wearing that jacket to this very day. I did need it last night. Digger didn't need it the other day on the football field. And none of us need it now. It's enough of this shit. All right, all right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, exactly, that's exactly what it is. Right. You, that's from me. You, out of here. It's cool, I punched him. So what have we gotten from this film so far? A Couple of good performances from Corey Feldman. Sh shockingly, but you know what? Actually pretty good. We'd like to see you in the family. Has he still got that jacket on? He loves it, man. It is him now. That is... He's a Tai Chi guru? I'm not sure I can believe I am who you say I am. Or if I just want you to want me more. Wait, what did that... So did they leave or did they have... They... Do you think so? Oh, yeah. Or we could lose him forever. How do you... I don't know. I'm anxious to mature as the next girl, but I'm not looking to... They... Uh... <laughs> audience. <laughs> Did they... Or not? Let me tell us. Seriously, comment below. It helps the algorithm. Please, God. <laughs> you know, someone commented, Hey, it's strange that these two guys are really upset about the nerd and the fat guy. <laughs> and I was like, I don't know. It's probably projection, dude. We're both both, okay? <laughs> Oddly a more serious film than it needs to be. Yeah, it is really serious, isn't it? It's a lot heavier. But this is the serious body swap film. This <sighs> one's not for kids. Yet it has teen stars. Oh good, he's wearing pants now. I just want to tell you that what you said last night made us do a lot of thinking. You were right. We don't listen to your problems. Thank you. Yeah, whisper it so old people job. can't understand the dialogue. <laughs> I didn't get any of that. I'm so focused on what's not working. Though. Okay, so this is the dance. That's 80s. This is more realistic. That's 80s. That people are sitting on the thing, not dancing. Hoop earrings like that. And then she's suddenly way more stylish. He, oh my God. Just I thought, opened in the hallway? I no. thought he was wearing the jacket, but he just, yeah. Walking by the administrators, like it's fine. Yep. They don't know what's in it. Wow. He doesn't have that jacket on, but his coat is the exact same color as the jacket, so you don't forget who the character is. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I get mad. Extra bonus if you can catch the continuity break. Never mind. He is running, running on a broken leg. On a broken leg. Oh, here comes Asshole. You gonna let the drunk guy drive? It's interesting to use devices like that so late into the film. Got a little more of this. Yeah, are they gonna die? And I forgot you. What do you? I don't remember that. You gonna drink it? You could drink it, drive, and get a gun, and your friends. <laughs> what are you gonna do with the gun, Joel? The gun. Hey man, it was the '80s. Join it's the cool. The bridge, man. And the first guy that pisses me off gets a little surprise. Joel, <laughs> You're going to prison forever. <laughs> right now, you are. <laughs> I'm not going to let this shit slide. Look, man, I'm not going to be responsible. This guy's performance is terrible. It is. Like, Haim is killing it compared to this guy. Yeah, Haim seems like a, a real dude who's as confused as we are. Out! Out! Go, man. Hey, man. That guy's going to shoot Feldman? I don't think that's enough to shoot him. I think he'd be more sad that his old lady got stolen. Joel's going after Dumas. 
He's a big Who are you? Take care of himself. I've got things to do. Oh, you have things to do. Great. So so I shit on a friend for you for what, Bobby? Oh, Mustang guy's going to go gonna kill go um punk rock jacket guy. got to go. Oh, who cares? That is crazy to me that Corey Haim is balling so hard, you know, drugs, whatever, but he's also riding motorcycles like the week before mm -hmm. and teaching his mom that What kind of life was this dude leading? An the, awesome one. The one where he can be in a movie with a Thunderbird and an Alfa Romeo with a V8. That's crazy. Yeah, engine. <laughs> <laughs> They're killing it. Let's say this film isn't the best ever, but it's still something you can know, get something from and it's a little deeper than the not but Corey Haim's performance is pretty dang good for what he's look at that his Symbol nails are dirty that symbolism we talked about how the two Corys were heroes like they were living that life yeah. and you didn't have the internet to go into that like minutia and detail of like their douchebaggery you just thought they were cool so this just went to a different level yeah, some guy just fired a gun. He's going to kill those punks. Yeah, I'm... All right, now I know that that's not a good thing to do, right? <laughs> She's making... oh, 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 they're going to knock her out. Then why did you take a... They're going to roofie her. Why did they take a taste of that? Oh, well, you know. Little well, roofie never heard. Nope. Yeah, my mom's boyfriend roofied me last night. No problem. Ron. Hey, Grandpa, we borrowed your car. <laughs> well, I borrowed your... Whoa. Jesus. What else? All right, what are we all doing here, guys? What are we all here for? Because I kicked Tomas's ass? So what? Big deal. I have been living my life day by day for so long that I can't even remember why I hate Tomas. So. And now breezes seem to whisper, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would have been great. Goes Let's the black. Back. Life is too short, guys. You turn around, one second, bam. Teenager problems, huh? Back in the day? I guess so. Wow. I had bigger problems than all of these problems. A lot to deal with in uh, the suburbs. They're only writing for rich people. Ruin. Why don't we do that right don't now? Take off what, why don't you shoot the monster? Ooh, guy? he's taking off the bandage. Why would you take off the bandage? You wouldn't do that. <laughs> Not for a fight, you'd want to know. Come on. That'll make you feel good. Hey, take off your cast. Joel. Would you stop pointing guns at people's faces? <laughs> and they do all have lattices. What was it on Family Guy? They were like, what? Why is there a lattice here with the to the bedroom? I feel like there's a better way to do that. Yeah, he's doing he's, oh, right, he, he's doing the no, Neil Breed. Right, he read the... no, <laughs> And you know that stuff I told you about losing Gina and all that? Well, I made it up. So everything was okay no matter what? She dances to 80s music. Yeah, nothing happened at all. Dream a little dream was a long dream. Who gives a shit? It's an old people film. It, yeah. it really is. This The, the wrap up here is very long and it's all based on the old man. Why is he physically beat up but his knuckles aren't? But he punched through the window as Corey why didn't? He, why is he learning something from this when he was just hanging out in Dream World the whole time? Yeah. So they don't cut through his house anymore, even though they're friends now, and he could give him permission because they're such buddies. So I know that everyone's nostalgic about this movie, and they really love it, and that it's a great Corey performance. This movie sucks. <laughs> unless. <laughs> Not unless. There's no unless. You vote. No. <laughs> it is its own little story and tells it relatively well, just packaged in a way that I'm not really interested in. Let us know in the comments what you think, what you think we should be watching next. We do look at your comments and uh, believe it or not, when we run out of ideas or are too lazy, we'll just take from your list. And we're lazy a lot. Yes. Back There's to the sofa. So much. Just trying to get back here. I'm not doing this dance. I never said I would do this This dance. is the dance that we have to do. Wait, this counts. Yeah, we're gonna dance. We're just as good. We're on the sofa, you're right. We, we're, everything's on the sofa.
Is that a wrestling belt? What is he wearing on that, uh, Corey? What is? It's so big. <laughs> I hit my arm. <laughs> what about this? <laughs> Jesus twins, anyone? All right, I can dance like that, gentlemen. Right. Okay. Spirit of Corey. <laughs>